So, so the next treat is going to require candy melts and whatever color, doesn't matter, you'll see why. Some M&M's. I got Easter ones because I really like the colors. Some um, pretzel squares. And you're going to heat your oven up to 250. Almost there. And you're going to put a, a candy melt in the middle of each square. And then we're going to throw it in the oven for about three minutes until it melts. Okay, my pretzels have been in the oven for about three minutes. And as you can tell, when I say melted, they don't melt all over the place. They're just soft. And then, it is hot. But to make your flowers, you put one in the middle. And six around making sure that it gets a little bit of the chocolate I would be very careful because it is hot like I just right and you continue with each one until you have them all made. Aren't they beautiful? Okay, so I'm going to suggest that you don't touch them. Once you got the chocolate on there, don't really touch them until you're ready to put them in the fridge. And even then, just put the whole thing in the fridge for a few seconds because that will help set them up. But I've learned the hard way that if you move them around, the chocolates fall off. You also have to work a little fast. So when I did this with my granddaughter, it was a bit of a challenge for her to get going. She was um, a little too meticulous with how she put them on and the chocolate got a little hard. So it didn't work out too good for her. But you just continue until you have all your chocolates on the pretzels to make these cute little flowers. And now you know why I used the Easter. These would be fun with um, like the 4th of July. You could do red, white, and blue ones. That would be fun. Anyway. That's how you do it.